good everybody so this is a course simpson we're still celebrating over fit to our fashion and there's something astonishing something beautiful happening just closer to i mean victoria park where tomorrow's day but grand deba is going to take place so i met the brother who paints with his mouth this is this is really astonishing look at that and he's done a lot of paintings if you look around you realize there are a lot of paintings that he has done here and this is all so 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 awesome and he mentioned that very soon he's going to organize an event here where you can come and learn how to paint and everything so i'm entreating you let me give you the name of uh this shop that's it over there meat mouth painting artist he's the one right here yes sir echo, echo, echo city. Hey, right, so this is Echo Simpson currently giving you a live update of what is happening today. Today is Friday, so uh, they are parading this cow to, oh, look at that, to a certain part of Cape Coast where they are going to slaughter this cow. That's the beginning of uh, some of the rituals that must be done here according to uh, the event happening within Ogwafe to Afashe. biggest festival ever to be celebrated in Cape Coast. And I'm meeting one of the nice girls in Cape Coast. Give me, give me blue. Eh? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yo, soja. So what you see right now is part of the rituals when it comes to Ogafe to Afashe. Oh God, be careful. So at this point, uh, there, is, there is a need for a ritual that must be done. And this involved uh, slaughtering a cow. Slaughtering a cow. So that is what you see. These guys trying to send uh, the cow to where they have to uh, slaughter it. Whilst they move, they are being followed by a long procession of the queens and the kings and the priests uh, of the 77 gods here in Cape Coast. So I'm going to turn the camera and then you will see where, where we are right now is called Inton and we are heading towards Prapratim. Prapratim is where the slaughtering of the cow is going to take place. Look at these people, quite a number of people who are yearning to see how it's going to go. Now on the other side of my camera, you can see the long procession of the, um, the kings and queens. So we are celebrating 
Mugwafe to Afashe at 60. And like I said, this is part of the ritual that must be done. traditional area of Sabarima with Yata the second. That is it right there in the red, um, having a red uh, cloth around the head, wrapped around the head. So this is exactly where
the animal, we were asked not to make a video. But after the slaughtering, I think this is the outcome. Everything has been done. The court has been purified. Uh, this is another uh, proprietor. Yes, uh, the court has been purified. The cow has been slaughtered and the blood uh, used for their spiritual or ritual uh, meat. So at the end of the day, the slaughtering of the cow has been performed by the Ogwa Manhin Osa Berima. And during that time, we were asked not to film it because this is a ritual, this is a, this is a respected tradition. So this is aftermath of the uh, cow that has been slaughtered. This is this is my first time of really seeing uh, the slaughtering of the cow. I've, I've, I've never seen it. Even though I'm from here, I've been enjoying this festival over the years, but I've never been to where the cow has been slaughtered. And mind you, this time I'm working with a tag, so I'm officially covering this program here.